Good morning, everyone. Today is Tuesday, the 5th of January. <laughs> Happy New Year to everyone. So this is an address direct to our student population. Uh, from me, just to say, it's OK. Our Prime Minister made an announcement last night, which did take us by surprise somewhat. We probably knew something was coming, but the fact that you are now at home again is not what we want. Face to face, learning on site is how you learn best. But don't worry, since March 20th, we have learned an awful lot about blended learning and learning from home. And today, and tomorrow, and for the rest of this week, your teachers and the leaders in this school will be working really hard to make sure that everything that you need to continue your education is there for you. We have a huge selection of online materials for you, which includes Google Classroom work, Oak National Lessons, and all the other third-party websites and companies that we've bought into because we know that they can deliver excellent information to you at home. Your teachers will be in touch with you, our pastoral leads, our heads of year, and our wellbeing team will make regular contact with you. My only request for you at this time is to look after yourself. Don't become overwhelmed. Don't log into Google Classroom and see hundreds of activities and think you need to achieve them tomorrow. But at the same point, give yourself a routine. We need to think, what did we learn last year? What did we learn from the March 20th lockdown experience? We learned that routine and consistency are what you need to keep yourself mentally and physically in check. So keep that in mind. We're very pleased to know that Jill Wicks has returned on a Monday morning, so you've got your morning pee lessons sorted. And all joking aside, please do think about utilizing opportunities to keep yourself mentally and physically fit. Your well-being is priority to us and potentially even more so in your academics in the next few weeks. So we'll be making sure that the resources that we send home to you and your parents are a mixture of academically challenging stimulating work but also resources for you to really think about yourself and to think about the situation we're in and to help you with that. As ever we are here, we're at the end of the telephone. We're at the end of an email. Your parents can contact us and you can contact your teachers directly. Our year fives will not have experienced a home learning setup yet. And it'll be very different probably to how you experienced lockdown in year four. Your form tutors in particular will reach out to you and we'll make sure that you understand the processes and the plans that we've got put in place. For now though, my message to you is today just to be kind to yourself and relax. This is a challenging time nationally, but the end is in sight. Please try and block out some of the negative comments that probably are already appearing in social media and the news. We don't need to worry about that. Let the politicians worry about that. Let the adults worry about that. You and your priority is basically to keep calm and carry on. I'll make sure there are plenty more briefings for you and I look forward to seeing some of you on my lessons in the coming days and weeks and back in school as soon as it is safe to be so. Take care and be well.